What's that? I'm baby free again. I feel like I was missing something. The whole ride here, I'm like, am I missing something? Yes, I'm missing a baby attached to my body. Anyway, I'm at Home Goods right now, and I plan to go to TJ Maxx today. Fingers crossed that we get there and that they have all of the new amazing, well, amazing, I don't know, uh, like Easter, spring stuff out. I'm gonna shop inside and show you guys everything new that they have for the new season. What I need is a water bottle and... <laughs> I don't know what else, let's find out. I wore purple for spring and... You know, I bet they have some summer stuff out here too. I actually don't think I'm gonna grab a cart, but look at all of the, like, look at these rocking chairs. All right, let's peek the price, guess that right. 300 for a rocking chair? I think it's less at Costco, but they don't look that nice, right? Even greater savings on these two. Ooh, actually, these are on clearance, only 320, hey. Excuse me, I'm trying to film. All right, thank you. Check this out. This was still here from last time we came, but I don't, maybe it's such a tight squeeze, no one wants it. They're like, where the heck am I gonna put my legs, you know? This little outdoor set is 600. What a rip. What a rip. The sign doesn't even wanna stay up. Outdoor furniture is so dang expensive, but if you get the quality pieces, hopefully they'll last for a long time. Like whatever set this is, see how nice this is and how nice the pillows are. They're not gonna flop around. Well, at least I don't think so, but good Lord, are you gonna pay the price? And this is a better price than you'll find like online anywhere else, but look for deals because summertime is coming up. So Lowe's, Home Depot, everyone's gonna have sales. I don't know who else sells summer stuff, maybe Wayfair online but look at this whatever they have going on here i'm digging it that's oh my god 500 dollars for that does it open can i store stuff in it no it's just a seat does it spin doesn't even spin you guys 500 dollars for a stationary but it does come with three pillows so hashtag worth it 100 for that not so bad a couple of drawers oh you know where i've been wanting to go lately all this leprechaun stuff behind these carts here i've been wanting to go to ikea I feel like I need something from there, but I forgot what it was. Do you even want to see the St. Patty's Day stuff? I don't. <laughs> These guys are pretty cute. All right, but I don't really celebrate that. Do we consider that a holiday? I don't know. Is it offensive that I don't celebrate it? I don't, again, I, don't judge me, I don't know. But off the corner of my eye, I did find some bunnies over here. These are looking really cute. Oh my gosh, oh, every single backup cashier, you better get your rear ends to that cash register pronto. <gasps> Wait, check this chair out. Okay, I am not in the stage of like getting ready for my new office yet because they haven't even, they're not even halfway done with the addition. But this is a nice, I don't see a price on it. I was spinning it around to look for one. And then these things, I like the color of these. Ooh, 50 bucks, not so bad. It's lightweight, it's got wheels, cheaper than Ikea. I think, maybe not, mm, I don't know. Also not Easter, but look at this. That little decor piece with the chicks, that's really cute. And the chicks with the Easter ears on them, the bunny ears. All right, we've got some wreaths down there. Ladders, platters are always fun, but then I feel like if you put crap on top of it, how are you supposed to see the cuteness, right? Oh my gosh, that's only six bucks. It's a screaming deal. All right, check these guys out. They're cute too. Oh my word, is wicker back? This thing is really cute. Obviously it's Ray Dunn, but check the back too. The little tail, oh, the little cotton bunny tail, whatever it is. All right, is there anything else here you wanna see? Oh, they have the, um, the egg wreaths. I actually don't, I just stepped into the store, camera on. I have, I didn't peek around yet. Normally, sometimes I do that. They've got, oh, they're like the jumbo carrots. Remember when this was like all the rage? I actually really like that bunny back here. Did your parents, I feel like my mom was always into like the things with the fur on it, you know? I don't know, it's pretty cute. Also not for me, that's cute too. Stop it right the heck now, okay. Got leftover Valentine's Day stuff, but we don't care about that. We actually do care about this bistro set over here and the music blaring on the radio. It's in sync. It's time to leave and it's $130. It's metal. It's pretty sweet. <gasps> okay, it ain't no lie. Home Goods has all this new Easter stuff. Bye bye. Bye to Valentine's Day. Hello to this. Look at her dress. Oh my gosh, does it come in my size? It's darling. I love her hairpiece too. <gasps> and her little basket. Oh my gosh. She okay, guess that price. I'm gonna guess 60. Go big. Oh my gosh, I didn't actually think it was going to be 60. I was doing like prices right rules, you know what I mean? Oh man, that's that's a lot for her. But she's worth it. She knows her worth. 
Oh my gosh, speaking of Easter baskets, I didn't even see these before. Look, they like nestle inside of each other like Russian dolls. Oh my gosh, it matches the table. This is darling. Okay, guess this price is probably like $14.99. Holy hell, $20. I'll tell you something. It is really nifty and good for storage because you can do that with the handle, whereas so many baskets, I'm like, this doesn't fit in any of my storage bins. So that's really cool. And they go to really big sizes too. Bunny Hop Radio, I'm sure there's some jams on that station. Oh, this is for outdoor. This is $80, this like outdoor piece right there with the eggs. All right, let's just look around. I actually already got a couple of things, decor pieces for Easter, and they were really large. I ran in one day after my um, dental appointment. Look at this, oh, they, okay, that would be fun. I don't know what you would put in here, if you could even put food in there or what. This Easter basket's fun too, oh my gosh. Speaking of baskets that are floppy and good for toy storage, um, I heard they no longer sell kid stuff here. <laughs> And by kid stuff, I mean like baby toy, like kid toys. You know what I mean? Kid stuff. The fun stuff that they have. This house is really cool. Oh my gosh, this house is way cooler though. Or is that a joke? It even lights up inside. I'm pretty sure I see some wires in there. This is the cutest thing. Okay, guess that price. It does light up. $40. I feel like we always got these in our Easter baskets. Happy Easter. Like, oh, is it full of candy? Ours was. I don't, I didn't know they came like that. Seven bucks. I'm gonna pass on that. But look at these eggs. I love, I mean, not eggs. I love how they look nothing like carrots. All right, well, I mean, they kind of do obviously, but okay, moving on. <gasps> do we want to see the pots for spring? Uh, or do we want to go that? I guess we'll do this way first. Let's just overview really quickly because, <laughs> you know, we gotta get home quick. Actually, I like that floral arrangement. Doesn't look very realistic, but whatever. No floral arrangement in my house is ever going to look realistic because Everyone knows I cannot keep anything alive. Actually, I like the look of this thing. Where could I put that for 70 bucks? Ooh, I like this. I'm glad I don't have a cart. All right, check out these wreaths on the back wall. Obviously all those planters. I like them, I like the colors. I really like this one. But then like, what is this material? I don't even know, I don't know. I don't know what they're made out of, but they're $25 each and then they have that one, that one looks really nice. These over here, I'm loving the print on them. They kind of remind me of Lizzie McGuire. You too? And I love how they're different sizes. But also I would like some, two of them the same size. More pots down here. Is it weird that I want like all the pots even though I kill everything? Is that like, like what's the therapy behind that? Where's the logic? Because I don't understand. These stone mushrooms, not worth $40 in my opinion. But this guy totally is. Look how beautiful. They have a few cute beach chairs over here. These are looking really nice. Oh, wait, are they Tommy Bahama? No, business and pleasure. It's really funny. They have more of these wind chimes, always a hit. And then if you want to spend $100, you can get like a backdrop for Instagram or something. I don't know. They also have one over here. It's a little bit larger. It's looking real cool. Okay, let's come down here. These are fun for your outdoor adventure areas. Oh my gosh, look at those owls. Oh, and the frog. Oh, is that a cat? That cat's my favorite. That is my favorite. Oh my word, look at this beautiful lady with the butterflies. I really love her. Why do I love her? What is? What do they call that, a bust? Oh my gosh, she looks so happy. Ah, oh, I love her. If I had a card, she'd, she'd be in it. And then I'd come home with it and be like, why did, you know, why did I buy that? It's completely unnecessary. Looks like they've got some spring candy over here. They always have some really unique candy. Look, butterfly, gummy butterflies. That's so cute, candy corn for spring. Oh my gosh, all you candy corn lovers are rejoicing. All right, should I get some, well, I don't have a cart. Should I get some candy for Easter? For their Easter baskets? Oh, and then look at this caramel popcorn. In a, oh gosh, in a bunny. That hurt my abs to catch that. Oh, I'm so out of shape. <laughs> All right, they have a whole end cap over here, Belgian chocolates. They've got bunnies with their, I don't know, jars full of candy. These, I will never understand. These are the hardest things that I've ever tried to eat in my entire life. More candy down here. Oh, look how cute these are too. Oh my goodness, these are adorable. $5 for six of them. Milk, chocolate, eggs for the win. Look at these, white chocolate pretzels. I, don't, I must be hungry. And you know what, I definitely am hungry. I should have eaten before I left. These are 
darling. Are these marshmallows? Oh, yeah, I'm glad I don't have a card. There's more candy back here. Why, what, why is candy so fun? Maybe just because I like to eat it, right? Okay, so here's something I've never seen before. Hot chocolate kit. Includes five servings of pink color changing hot cocoa, delicious peeps, marshmallow chicks to place on top. That's pretty fun, right? I know there's going to be one item that I see that I'm just going to be like, oh yeah, I'm just gonna go get a cart right now, okay? So I'm just wondering what that item is going to be. Definitely not this. Carrots for the Easter Bunny? Wait. Do we leave carrots for the Easter Bunny now? Oh my gosh. I want... <laughs> That's too much. It's too much to keep up with. Oh, a wood stand kit. All right, that's a little craft for the kiddos. Some more hot cocoa kits. Some more... Oh, be kind, be happy. That has nothing to do with bunnies. <laughs> oh, this is really cute. Oh my gosh, are those cookies? How are those still good? I mean, I'd eat them. Yeah, that looks really cute, right? Okay, and then over here we have a whole wall, aisle, if you will, of uh, really fun stuff. Okay, happy Easter. It's springtime, time to rejoice. I don't, I don't know. I don't know the song that's on the radio, so it's the best I can do. Holy cow. Oh, and Anna Lee. Those Anna Lee dolls are always so dang cute. Happy Easter. Glad it doesn't say hoppy, because that always annoys the crap out of me. All right, some more bunnies. Oh, I like the ducks with under the umbrella. It's really sweet. Some eggs, if you're into that. Oh my goodness, she is just so beautiful. What? What is that? I don't understand that, but okay. She's just saving that for later, I guess. Some gnomes up here. Oh my gosh, a butterfly gnome. Is this a joke? That is the cutest. Oh my gosh. Well, I don't have a cart, so there's... <laughs> There's that. All right, here's a couple more. Wait, you know how they do this for like every season now, the nutcrackers, but it's, you know, it's a bunny. Okay, what else do we have? We have some gnome garland. Do you decorate? I find that ever since we moved, I do not, I rare, hardly decorate. Not rarely, but I, I barely put anything out. These are really cute though. Mostly because I don't have like flat surfaces to put anything out on. Okay, the bunnies are really sweet, even though I don't like stuffed animals, but I know some kids are gonna go crazy over that. Oh, those squash mellows, I tell you. They're a trip, aren't they? You know what I saw the other day? Like ramen noodle squash mallow. All right, here we go. That is a cute bag, if I do say so myself. Got some dishware over here, some fine dining. I'm not at this stage of life, but maybe, no, I don't even think one day I would. But this is really sweet, this caught my eye. It's colorful, it's cute, and it's painted by hand. Yes, that $13, and then this platter over here. That's so sweet. All right, anything else you see? No. There's more over here. Love this platter too, the carrot platter. And then they have a carrot silicone mold, a baking mold. I think I'm gonna make carrot cake for Easter. Uh, my aunt has a really good recipe she's gonna share with me, so maybe I'll share it with you if it's not like a secret family recipe. <laughs> I don't know. What's this for, dog food? It's like two bowls. What do we put in here? Two kind of schmears for your bagel? Oh my word, I found the Mecca of Heavenly Hunka Chunks. I think these are my favorite, the cranberry white chip. Pretty sure that's it. You know what's crazy? Here's more candy. But when I went to Marshall's to make those returns and I was like two days past the return policy, I had these and she wouldn't even take these back. I was like, Really? Like, you still sell them. It's not a holiday item. I'm clearly still salty about it. Like, can't, like, what if I never showed you my receipt? Would you then take my crap back, you know? <laughs> anyway, here are some more plates, some more festive, fun things. This is like lemon, summertime. Did you know there's a Lulu Lemon outlet store? Not one near me. It's in Orlando. It's about, I don't know, two hours away. Oh my goodness, the Krabby? What is this? A bowl? That's pretty fun. I don't know what I would ever put in it, but that's cool. All right, we've got You Crack Me Up down there, that platter that could be for Easter. A dinosaur? Oh my gosh, it's from I'm a Nervous Rex. Holy crap, that's hilarious. All right, this one's for bacon. Cool, now I know what that tray is for. Oh my gosh, they have toast too. 
In case you didn't know what to do with this, there you go, toast. This is not seasonal per se, but I crossed this path and I just thought, huh, that's cute. Also this down here. Also, what are they doing here? What's happening here? I don't know. Oh my word, a sushi set? How cute is that? I don't eat sushi enough to enjoy that. But if you do, there you go. Show me the good stuff, that's right. I'm talking about the egg tray. I actually have an egg tray with a lid and it holds like 24. It's amazing. Someone sent it to me, but I'm pretty sure it's on Amazon. Oh, here you go. All the muted tones for the season. Look at these bunnies. Oh, they're so trendy. I really like that tiered tray, but I just decluttered a tiered tray, so I definitely don't need one because I know I'll never use it, but these are really sweet. Looks like they have some wreaths behind me for the season. Oh my gosh, wait, oh, I see baby stuff. I thought they got rid of it. Oh my goodness, I'm crying. Look how sick and cute with the little bone. Oh my goodness. Oh my word, check this one out. Oh, what size is this? That's darling. And then they have this down here with the carrot. <laughs> it's like, do I want to spend $15 on something they're going to literally wear one time? I mean, they'll be immortalized in photos forever. Look at this tea cart, tea tray, whatever they call it. A $200, is that what that said? My gosh. This, oh, that's really cute. All right, moving on. Ooh, check it, oh my gosh. Check, 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 check it out. Look at this. Oh, you guys know how I love a good bowl and it comes with two spatulas? Is that a prank on us? For $15, that one up there has a handle. That one's always a winner. Different print over here. And then, you know what I see back here? Picks. Those are always really cute. Oh my gosh, is that a cat? Is this Peter Rabbit? Oh, darling. And then some baking cups. You know, I think I bought some for Valentine's Day. Never used them. Never used them. I don't know what I was thinking. I actually think I had that set. I did use that for Easter one year. Um, these are really cute. They always do a good job on their cupcake and topper sets. So if you're planning on making cupcakes or something, that's really sweet. This one looks nice too. It says Happy Easter with the toppers. Oh, is Yoda still a thing? Apparently it is. I don't know, for some people, I guess. You know, there's that one on out there that's like, oh, I just love Yoda, and she's still getting Yoda stuff every holiday. <laughs> Ooh, a baking tray. <gasps> I'm ready for lemon. Springtime lemon bars. That's the only thing you're allowed to make in here. Oh my gosh, I actually do need a tray uh, like that at nine, to, 9 by 13 because... Oh, look at these wreaths too. Hold on, let me back up so you can see them all at once. Anyway... I ended up throwing mine out. It just got chipped so much over time. And uh, the last time I used it, it would have just taken me five hours to clean it. And I just said, okay, time for the garbage can. <laughs> uh, so no more ceramics for me. I don't think I gave this enough attention. This uh, garland, that's really cute. I just saw the cutest pan. So remind me to go back to the pans. It was like a single egg size pan. I'm trying to show you the new colors for your tablescape if you're looking to decorate your tablescape. I don't know. And then all these table runners. Is this a shark? No, it's a bunny. That makes a lot more sense. I saw this though, so my mind was going ocean. You know how many shark attacks there are a year? I think Florida is leading the shark attack numbers. And uh, not saying that's something to be proud of, but like we're number one in a lot of areas. Okay. <laughs> All right, number one worst school system, hands up. Just kidding. <laughs> Actually, it might be true, I don't know. I feel like it was when I was in school. All right, we have all these nice little tablecloths. Fun for springtime. And these always draw me in. I'm like, yeah, we need them. And then I'm like, Kim, just calm down. No, we don't, you know, but they're nice. Made it to the frying pans. Check this out. Easy egg, the handle even has an egg on it. Look how cute that is, $6. Just one, if you cook one egg at a time, that is perfect for you, but I don't. I cook like 20 eggs at a time. Mmm, eggs are delicious. Speaking of eggs, I really want to get some chickens. And those are some fun colors for the pots. Cool. I just overheard someone say, how cute is this? And I second that. Okay, I'm going to back her up on whatever she wants to purchase. Check this out. How cute is that? For your molds what kind of things are we gonna make for easter and springtime got some eggs over here all those silicone molds i actually don't see the 9 by 13 pans over here i see the uh, loaf pans and the cooking sheets 
You know? That, oh, look at these bowls. They nest inside of each other. I feel like I need a nice size bowl. Like all my bowls are either too big or too small. That's like the perfect size. I, I although, <laughs> okay, I don't need another bowl, but in my head I'm like, buy them all. I do need another baking dish like this though. And I really like this one. I'm not gonna get it because I'm never gonna use the lid. I just have to talk myself out of it, you know? That's why I don't get a cart. It's not worth it. But like sometimes it is, especially when I'm shopping for you. All right, what's over here? Oh, they took the, oh no, they don't. They still have that wall over there. I guess they just had to expand it over here. The professional dough kit. Don't let that draw you in. What do you, what, no. Although I do feel like I need to get measuring cups and these are, oh my gosh, these are really nice. Is that a one cup? It's huge. It's shallow though. In the shack. I really like those. I really like these too. These are looking cute. I don't know, I don't measure anything, so why do I need my, I feel like I need them, I don't know. I feel like I'm gonna carry these around. Okay, more bunnies over here. Oh my gosh, this bunny is just the sweetest. Look at his cheeks. Oh, same. Okay, more bunnies down here. These are more puffy, plushy, but not, you know what I mean? All cute, all different, we're all different. All right, here's some more. I'm not sure what this is, a blanket set. Is that necessary? I'm sure some people find it to be not me though. I'm like drowning in blankets. I got so many dang blankets. I need to declutter my blankets. Oh, those are cute though. These gnomes are massive and they must be from last season or something. That one is on clearance. These, oh my gosh, she is darling. Look at her. I love the rainbow hair. <gasps> More clearance? Oh, somebody pull me away. I don't have enough hands. Oh, hand soap. <gasps> oh my gosh, I do need hand soap. All right, I need a cart if I see some hand soap. The clearance, I don't need to be down here, but here I am taking one more step further. All right, I got it. Oh, what's on the other side? <laughs> I love that they sell the dash makers here. Oh, look, they have a rainbow one, probably for like, um, what's the leprechauns, you know what I mean? Obviously it could be for any day. Oh wait, they sell the blend jet at Costco. This is 25. But I think the one at Costco is a two set and it might be bigger, I don't know. Oh, look, a man. I think you're like a woman. I feel like I need to do another giveaway. Look at orange juice, a citrus juicer. Oh my gosh, I really want some salsa. Ooh, I found some water bottles. Now, here's my thing. I need one that will fit. I'm, I'm not buying a Stanley, okay? Not for myself. But I need one that's gonna fit in my cup holder, holds a lot of water and has a straw. But not like, I need a straw that I can also close and bring to the gym. I don't think any of these fit those qualifications. All right, so I guess we're moving on. Look at these though. Are these carrots? Salt and pepper shakers. Are those carrots or pineapples? I don't know. <laughs> you know, my weakness is the cleaning product. Little section they have over here. Check it. Lemon. How? I mean, I obviously have to carry this around. Lemon verbena. Ooh, that's like my all time. Also lime and verbena. I'll, you know what? I'm gonna smell it before I carry it around. All right, well, I'm gonna leave it for what it's worth. Not my favorite, not worthy enough for me to carry around. Oh my gosh, I love people so much. I just heard a woman explaining the buy of the century and I'll show you what she was talking about in a minute. But look at this, like a muted detail crab. They have pineapples back there in the back. You see them? Um, not too many spring themed, which I'm kind of surprised about unless they're already all sold out, which also wouldn't surprise me because <laughs> what is it? The middle end of February. I'm surprised they don't have Christmas stuff out. Who's joking around now? All right. These oven mitts, mine, I've probably had for a year. And sadly, I don't know if the stuff I'm touching is too hot, but they're like getting holes in them. Oh, it's so sad. I don't know. Maybe I need to get a silicone one or something, but anyway dish oh some people get themed dish um what do they call that drying dishes whatever that thing is. i think i do i ha are mine themed is mine christmas oh my gosh i'm embarrassed for myself anyway i like it and i'm still using it <laughs> is it sad i don't even know what kind mine is also weird no themed aprons where are we is are am i in home goods okay look what i see behind me though a bread box i feel like i've always wanted these but now that i don't have it i'm like really glad i don't have it oh my gosh i almost forgot to show you the buy of the century it looks like someone like oh no that's a clear okay these kitchenaid scissors you guys know i got some 
Last time I came here, she said six dollars. She said no one's buying these for six bucks. Apparently, she spent over twenty-five. Unless I heard her incorrectly, and maybe she said more. I don't know. That'd be really crazy. Look at these spreaders too. These seem really nice. All right, they've got ooh a happy salad. I want to be happy. Is that what it takes? Do I need this? All right, they've also got a whole line. What it was that, an egg thing? A funnel? A funnel that squeezes. Easy storage. I feel like I'm in Ikea already. Oh, look, this is fun for springtime. All the colorful things. Those look nice. Okay, I normally don't come down the pillow aisle, but I told you a while ago that they, like, rearranged in here, so I'm not used to avoiding this spot yet. The, um, oh gosh, hedgehog, is that what that is? Shamrock and roll. I gotta go. Oh, look. Look at these over here. Happy Easter. They've got some festive blankets and pillows, and I feel like my finger is about to fall off. It might fall off. Maybe I'll do the thumb. Anyway, I like, I really like the seashells and stuff. Like the beachy theme stuff. Actually love the beachy theme stuff. Surprised to see so much of it. Um, now I see a laundry basket. I'm like, do I need another laundry basket? I need hand soap. Where the heck is all the hand soap? Wait, what's down here? Dogs on a beach? Of course, of course we have to see this. Is this a joke? Dogs at the beach. This is hilarious. It's exactly why I come to Home Goods. <laughs> Look what I found. Some dang hand soap. Uh, I'm gonna pass on whatever's there. But you know what? I just heard someone say, do we need some more throws? And my answer to her was, yes. <laughs> yes, you do. Do I need any? No. Because my kids throw them on the ground. That's what they do. Throw pillows. They throw them on the ground. Gosh, check these out though. Oh, the bunnies are so sweet. We've got carrots. We've got love bunnies. And we have bunnies going to work or church. They're sweet. Ooh, I like this one too. It's kind of like hippie, boho style. And you know, they always have a ton of furniture. This piece is on clearance for oh, wait, 550 bucks still. What is that, a couch table? Is that what they call that? Hence the couch. Ooh, sheets. I just got some sheets off Amazon. It seemed like the easiest way to go about it. I don't have the time to like sift through all this and then there's too many options and I'm like, I just want some beige sheets. Oh my gosh, should I go all out for the beach theme? I feel like that's more like hibiscus, tropical. I feel like half the lights are out in here. I also need some artwork for the girls' bathroom. Oh wait, we're also, oh. Oh my gosh, I thought there was a mirror behind me that I was gonna fall, but it's just a painting. And no, I don't have socks on. <laughs> Anyway, check these mirrors out. They're on clearance. A hundred bucks for that one. Look all around. These mirrors are, ooh, it's a Mary Poppins mirror. How much is this one? 50. It's a screaming deal. Anyway, their artwork is always a really good price for the size. If you like random artwork like that, that's okay. Like not the best thing I've ever seen, you know what I mean? <laughs> but if you need some artwork, uh, wait for a clearance. Oh, check behind me. Look at this, you want boats in the water? I'll set you back 130. Oh my gosh, even more mirrors. Are mirrors not all the rage anymore? Are people not wanting to see themselves anymore? All right, now I'm just embarrassing myself, which also isn't new. That's pretty cool though. All right, moving down, I'll show you some furniture. These pieces are decent prices for what they are because furniture is crazy expensive. Okay, I don't know where all the spring stuff is but they sure do have a lot of beach stuff i'm about to get this an accent rug where can i put this i want to know who selected the playlist for today because they are not blaring my 80s 90s old hits <laughs> anyway they've got like techno up in here where am i where's my grocery store tunes bunch of lamps i gotta get out of here oh look it's venice maybe i don't know some kind of canal Ooh, you know what? I was just getting into that song. Now it's over. <laughs> what a shame. I like that one. Looks kind of vintagey. Oh my gosh, actually, love. I feel like there was an old Vogue one and these are always like ridiculously expensive, like 80 bucks. I love this. If that was a cat, I would put it in my cart. Right now I would. Do they all look the same? Oh my gosh, they don't. Oh, I love the Vogue ones. I feel like they always have some really good ones. 
All right, let's see. Surprise me. Ooh, love her. <gasps> love, am I right? All right, ooh, spring collection ready to wear. So wait, spring collection? It's all black. Where's she going? Paris openings, Emily in Paris, is that you? Oh my gosh, wait, there's more. Wait, I thought there was more. I don't think, wait, is that Vogue? The Vogue, it is. Was she swimming? What is she doing? I need to know more, it says scan me, learn more about this piece. <gasps> Wouldn't that be fun? I could just spend like an hour here learning more about the pieces. Okay, well, these were all exactly the same. <laughs> Great. Look at that pelican. I saw a pelican the other day in Tarpon Springs, sponge docks. Oh yeah, yeah. Be kind to me. Look at this flamingo over here. That's like extra, extra. Oh my gosh, speaking of flamingos. Did you guys know they lose their color after they give birth? They lose their pink. That's right, takes them a while to get back to themselves again. And I can really relate to that. I see you, girl. Sometimes I forget that I'm just here to show you the spring stuff. And I just wanna browse, you know? I just wanna browse with my friends. Oh my God. All right, here's another piece. Look at this chair. I need to look for some really nice chairs. I saw one on Amazon that folds out into a, a bed. I don't, because there's like hardly any space in my future office, but that's really nice. Also, it should be for $500. We had a really windy day a few weeks ago and a couple of our frames broke, like flew off the wall and broke. So I'm looking for replacements. They're pretty large frames. I also need to replace all the pictures in my house because I don't know, they're old. You know, that whole spiel. Wait, I thought I saw candles. Okay, here are some candles. I'm gonna whiff on these. If they're DW, I'm sure they're delicious. Mmm, I don't know if they are DW. Oh my gosh, these are delicious. What is this? It doesn't even tell you a scent. Oh my gosh, I burned that. That one's not. This one is not. Plenty of DW candles here. However, I feel like I'm, like, these scents aren't my favorite. The springy scents, the florally, orange blossom though, I don't know. Mango Lagoon. I do like uh, apple, blossom, and rose. That's my favorite so far. Anyway, they've got like lavender haze happening down here. Dried lavender and haze. Oh, it's not for me. Beach house, I'm about to buy this. I bought it for one of my friend's birthdays. And now I'm like, well, should we match? I don't, like, do I need another candle? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, obviously, yes. I'm not gonna buy it, and then I'm gonna regret not buying it, because I'm never gonna see it again, you know? Oh my gosh, check it on the opposite side. Look, they have all these, like, candle things and stuff, but who cares? Okay. Raw honey and neroli this is my favorite scent. Oh my gosh, it's still so good. It's so good. If you want to find something very similar, I think this is more widely available, wild honey and nectar. It's similar, but wild honey and neroli is like where it's at. Ooh, these are, these are like my scents. The pineapple-y, the pineapple daisy. Even that one, I'll do that one. It's like so summery. Oh my gosh. Beach house though, I keep coming back. It's so fun. You know what's happening? I don't have my baby with me, so I'm like lollygagging. Like what is this? Freedom, freedom. Look at there. That's how they feel too on their moped. All these cookbooks. Wait, is that a Vogue? Ooh, look, they have a bunch of books. These would be nice for like coffee table books. Obviously not my coffee table, but these look like really nice books. Let's peek on, oh my gosh, the queen. 70 years of majestic style, yes please. And 20 bucks for that? Oh my word, look, a library bag. And it says Florida. <gasps> I love this, is this too much to spend on a grocery bag that will hold close to nothing? It's eight bucks. I love that. Oh my gosh, look how cute that is. Do you guys have Florida stuff where you live or is it just in Florida? <laughs> okay, I'm not gonna get this, but let me just look at it for a, like three more seconds. Check it, all the beachy stuff. Looks like it's on clearance. What, did no one want it? Oh, come on, where are all my kitschy people at? Decorating their house with fish. Okay, check this out. I totally forgot, I need to take a thumbnail. It's always like, takes me 20 minutes. Anyway, look at all of this, um, like paper products. What are those called, plates? Oh, bags, those, that's a cute idea, $4. Instead of like a basket, maybe just get bags for your kids to collect eggs. That would work too. Okay, check it. I found even more Easter baskets down here. These are really sweet. 
I don't know, it's like a different style of Easter basket. Oh, look at this one. They have all kinds. Happy Easter. Love that one. I feel like my kids have Easter baskets. I also don't know. Oh wait, Wolfgang definitely doesn't. Oh boy. Just kidding, he does. I forgot last year I bought five. I was thinking ahead. What's this though? Oh, a felt banner. Did you hear my knees crack? <laughs> okay, <laughs> bye. Ooh, check this out too. That's really nice. Oh my gosh, even more. Oh, I feel like this is a lesser traffic area. I could have taken my thumbnail here. Maybe I'll take another one. The first one sucked. All right, is there anything you see? The grass, is that edible? Did that trend stick around? Did anyone actually eat the edible grass? Did it taste good? What are these? Six alabaster eggs. They're made in Italy. Cool, 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 cool. Love it. I feel like it's rare to find two of the same type of chairs here. And these are really pretty. I'm trying to check. guess that price. Oh, they don't have a price. Okay, news alert. I'm pretty sure Wicker is back. I'm seeing it everywhere. All right, they've got an outdoor bar table over here. Oh, this is it. You guys, this is it. How much is this? $500 worth it. Well, maybe. Ours lasted a really long time. We used to have one of these. It was black though. And it didn't have like all of that. Oh my, oh my gosh, look at this computer chair. That is nifty. I mean, obviously I feel like I have to get in there. Okay, that was a good time. All right, well, I'm sweating. We found some more Easter stuff, spring stuff up front. Well, a lot of bunnies, really. Oh my gosh, fake chocolate covered. That would drive me nuts. Mm -mm, can't do that. Hopefully we find some hand soap at uh, TJ Maxx. Look at this sugar and creamer set. That's really cute. All right, all right, I can dig it. Chicks and bunnies and even more stuff. Happy Easter and stuff. Oh look, she's cute. I know at the checkout they usually have some random stuff. Life is better at the beach. Did you see that sign? Or did I blaze past it through fast? Too fast. Can Am I even speaking English? English is a hard language. <laughs> All right. Uh, oh, dish soap. I mean hand soap. That's what I need. That's what I came for and didn't even know. Ooh, more candles. Actually. Oh, that's the only um, thing that I see. Oh my gosh, Mother's Day, is that coming up? Mom's tea. Those systemic containers are really awesome. All right, behind me, nothing groundbreaking. Gotta tell you, sometimes they've got some really cool stuff up here, but today's not the day. Actually, that is amazing. Nintendo remote, I'm down. Did you play Nintendo? Did you play Sega? Did you play Atari? I don't know, you tell me. You know, I do this every time, but I'm pretty sure I like, this is gonna be loud, I'm bringing a card in. I'm pretty, okay, well, hold on. I'm pretty sure I enjoy TJ Maxx more than Home Goods because when I come here, I'm like, definitely grabbing a cart. You never know what you're gonna find. Am I gonna find an Easter dress? Probably. Am I gonna find a water bottle? Definitely. Hand soap? Yes. I've also been looking for like a little wallet purse. Obviously this does not fit the bill, but look at this thing. How do you even carry, oh my God. Oh, how do you carry it around? That's how. That's pretty fun. They have all these like trendy looking purses. Oh my gosh, check this out. $50 Vera Bradley Weekender bag. They've got Jessica Simpson always. Sometimes I find Lily Pulitzer here. Fingers crossed, that's my favorite. But I need something like really little, like really, like not even that big. Maybe something like this. Just to like fit my phone. Like even smaller, maybe just something to attach to my keychain but they have a bunch of like springy colors. And then check these two, loving, loving the purple hues, really cute. Something like this, but without all of this bulk. So maybe this one, that's like really simplistic. Maybe even this one, hmm, I don't know, maybe not. I found a Vera Bradley one. This one's on clearance for 18, but then I found this one and I, I don't know if your phone is supposed to go in this pocket or not, but wouldn't that be pretty neat? Is this like just for your phone? Now I'm confused. Hold on, let me crack this one open too. No, yeah, it's like got some stuff to hold your credit cards. 
and then you you tell me do i flip my phone in there so i can like see what's happening and possibly text back or whatever that would be very cool all right in all honesty i usually pay on my phone anyway so i'm not even sure they've got some makeup makeup bags travel addict I would say we need another hairbrush, but really I just need to find them around my house. I keep buying them for my children and they leave them in the car or whatever, their backpacks. Oh look, a watermelon purse. See that over there? They always have a really good selection of sunglasses. My aunt found some at the house and was like, I'm gonna wear these today. I was like, I don't even think those are mine. <laughs> I thought about going straight to the seasonal section, but do you guys ever go like the same route in the store, cute as a cookie? Oh, a face palette? Okay, well, I can't open it, so that's no buy. I saw something else. Oh, here. Maybe Lucky Charms or something? Oh, Summer Days. Summer Dreams make me feel fine. You know what's funny? They don't have any music on in this store. What's up? What is up with the music selection? Uh, Jessica Braun says these palettes are really good. So, hmm, there's that. Ooh, Bite Size Lip Balm? Okay, check it. I'm just going through the, uh, I don't know, what aisle is this? The self-care aisles. Found some Lumino strips up in here. 30 bucks. Hey, I feel like that's how much they are on Amazon. Ooh, apply and go. Hmm, don't know about that. I'm telling you, 2023 is going to be the year of dental health. Look at that. How much is this? Nine bucks for the jar and all of them. That's a screaming deal. Cotton pads? What? Cotton pads with a case? $5? Oh my gosh, pure grace lotion and a pump. But it's $20. Remember when I found hand soap for 20 bucks? I was like, uh, I'm not keeping this. <laughs> a little ridiculous. Check this out. It's bringing the 90s back. What does this smell like? Wish I could smell it. Oh wait, check. Pure grace. Huh, what's the difference? Ooh, Laneige. I use this stuff, I really like it. Lip sleeping mask, that's really good. Oh, another sleeping mask, hmm. Calming, how much is this? Oh, 20 bucks, that's pretty good. Cream skin refiner. I don't use any of those products. Oh, I do use this and I'm running out of it. Aww. I did find some festive hand soap, but I prefer the, oh look, I found it. What is this, lavender and chamomile. Well, I don't know if I'm gonna like that scent, but it's for the girls' bathroom anyway. I prefer the foaming, oh gosh, something just fell. The foaming hand soap. Oh gosh, can't go wrong with lavender and chamomile. What is this? Oh my gosh, it's a peep-shaped bath balm. $3? Ugh, oh, come on. Like get your own soap, you know, kind of thing. But these are really nice too, bunny kisses. You know what's funny? I got so much soap last year around springtime i'm still going through it like i'm on the last one <laughs> so trying not to do that again this time but also if it's a really good scent okay so here's three bath bombs oh gosh seven bucks i feel like i just got a bag of seven for four dollars really good brand right do you remember that it wasn't that long ago okay here's a whole set different scents but how much is this garbage 13 bucks so not bad i totally passed all of these oh wait hula girl animal cracker lemon custard Ooh, that sounds like a good time vanilla cake fresh cream warm cashmere what it, okay thank you philosophy that smells delightful wow that smells delightful. Okay, anyway, bunch of more bath bombs down here, bathed in elegance. Oh my gosh, the golden egg, how funny is that for a little Easter basket finding? So they've got some fun stuff down here too. Oh my word, is this the most adorable thing? It even comes with a scrunchie. Mama and me? Wait, where's mommy's size? Where's, what, where's mommy's? Oh my gosh, that would be adorable if they had one in my size, I would buy that. All right, well, now that's our mission to find one that matches. I actually really like that set too. I found that I really like matching pajama sets. I tried to a really long time ago and it just wasn't my thing. I think I just didn't find the right style. Like, I don't like a collar, I feel like I'm suffocating. And like, I don't like a lot of fabric. Oh, that's fun. Well, I don't think they have the mommy sets here. Just the me sets. 
Not that I see anyway. Ooh, look, a vision board. Okay, well, I'm just browsing around at this point. That peace sign down there, that's pretty cool. They have a bunch of coolers here, and this is where I have found like Lily Pulitzer stuff in the past. Just by the lunch boxes, the cooler section. I don't see anything now. Oh, you know what I do see though? Really large frames. Is that a set or just one? I think it's just one. Okay. What size is this? It's 24 by 36 for my future self to see if I can find a photo to fit. <laughs> this is definitely the kind of stuff that we need for Easter. Okay, hold on. The tajin, toasted corn, but that's not what I initially saw. Holy crap, peach rings with tajin. Eleanor would go crazy. <gasps> Dried fruit. Oh yes. Wait, on the rind? Keep it real, eat the, pe eat the peel? All right, we'll try it. If Natalie Bennett eats the peel of a kiwi, dang it, so can I. Sour gummies? That's what, the kind of stuff we need. Oh wait, cherry lovers rejoice. Heart-shaped gourmet jelly. Okay, well, Valentine's Day's over. Oh, they do have some Easter tea towels out. <gasps> I have some lollipops left over from last year, but those are gonna be fun for the kids because this year I will hopefully remember to put them out. Mallow flowers also fun. You know what? My uh, cousin just did a birthday party for her daughter and the theme was too groovy. She was turning two. Too groovy. Isn't that fun? So those, the flower shaped marshmallows would be great for that. Okay. Anyway, dish. Oh, that's all dish soap. I'm still looking for more hand soap. <laughs> Foaming hand soap. They've got really good cleaners here. Things that you wouldn't expect. I mean, you never know what to expect when you come to home goods, right? I guess we're at TJ Maxx, so boom shock lock. Happy spring. Oh, I love the bees. Do we need springtime? I feel like that's fun. That's like fun and fresh and yellow. Love the yellow. Oh, the chicks, those are cute too. I really like the yellow bees. But they have a lot of kitchen towels coming up on the water bottles here. Get ready for it. Actually, I would say this is not even most of the water bottles because they, yeah, maybe this is more like mug, mug style. Okay, a container grater. You know what, if I ever see one of those like spinny ones, I'll probably get that. I don't know why I won't buy it off Amazon. Oh wow, that is different. Okay, batter dispenser. What else can we find? I'm still needing a casserole dish. We made it to the mugs, happy birthday and all that good stuff. They have a lot of furniture out here. Is this the time to buy furniture? Ooh, Cottontail Market Farm. That's really cute. And Peter Rabbit over there to the left, salt and pepper shakers. Okay, so finally coming up to the seasonal stuff. The stuff we've all been waiting for, or have we? And then I'm gonna take a detour down here. <laughs> Ooh, some strainers. Okay, I have finally uh, I think I'm gonna finally jump there. I feel like someone sent me one, but I can't find it anywhere. And I might be, they may have sent me just like a typical strainer. So I always feel like I need one of those and I can never find it because I don't think I have one, <laughs> mostly. Oh wow, the first thing we've seen, he is risen. There we go, finally. Silly rabbit, Easter is for Jesus. There we go, we believe. Bunny kissed her Easter wishes. I know I love TJ Maxx. He is risen, that one's really cute. If you are still into the wooden signs with the words on them, they've got a lot here at the max. And then of course, all of this stuff too. This is actually really cute. If you're giving out like favors, party bags, that's fun. Oh my word. Finally used my flamingo towel the other day when we went to the beach. They have them here, more of them. When I was shopping, they only had one. I don't know how much it is. Oh my gosh, but they have more. Ooh. Okay, 13 bucks. Decent price for a beach towel, you know? It's like a really nice, uh, good size quality beach towel. Look, they have a bunch of cover-ups too. Oh, dreaming of the beach. Oh, I like this one. Now this, I don't understand. Nope, don't get that. But these are really cute. I don't want to buy all of, ooh, somebody. Okay, I'll get these. You talked me into it. Mine is falling apart. I've had it for way too long. Check that bunny out. Then they have basically everything on the same shelf, on different shelves. Same thing, different shelves. That's what I'm trying to say. And then down here, pretty cute. Now that's a cute coffee mug with the butterfly and the flower on it. Really like that. The riser's really cute. 
Um, more pots. Those are nice pots, nice size pots for herbs, I guess. I don't know, succulents. I kill everything. My succulents are kind of even dying because I neglect them. Ooh, okay. A ton of stuffies. Oh my gosh, a ton of stuffies up here. Gnomes, mostly bunnies. Maybe the gnome phase is over. I still like a good gnome. Look at that bee. He's cute. Oh my gosh, I think he's my favorite. He's my favorite. It's like a chocolate bunny, but he's fake. I love it, lasts forever. Okay, when I was a kid and I used to get chocolate bunnies, they would last forever too because I would eat like one bite at a time and save it and savor it. Look at these gnomes. I love her, that she has pigtails. <laughs> she's really cute too. Look at the print of her. Oh, she's beautiful. They have a bunch of organizing stuff. And then the candles. Ooh, lemon verbena and a candle. Oh my gosh, are you joking me? They have olive oil and a candle. Wow, that is interesting. And then they have mistletoe left over. Hey, come on down to home goods. I'm not looking for that stuff though. Do you ever have the smallest bit of something you want to save but don't have a perfect container for it? Finally, oh my gosh, $6. It's definitely got to cost more than whatever I'm saving in here. But this, there's salmon. Yeah, okay. I'm not eating salmon. Okay, $8 a pound on a sale. But those containers are some of my favorite. I'm in the clearance aisle again. I don't know what's wrong with me. Ooh, I love... What is this? The saxophone music they're playing? Okay, they have a lot of table runners here. Reminds me of kindergarten nap time. They don't do nap time in kindergarten anymore. Did you know that? Or more bags down there. Now this one's really cute. Not ten dollars? My gosh. Get me out of here. Oh wait a minute. Oh my gosh, hold on, what is this? Oh my gosh, the most adorable. Is this for a dog? It's gotta be for a human. And this is for the dog? Oh no, it's like a for your hair. Well someone changed their mind on that. <laughs> okay, here blankets, seasonal blankets, cool, cool, cool. And then they have a bunch of planters on clearance or sale. I don't know what the difference is but that's pretty cool. All right, I'm in the, uh, I thought I was in the dress section. I don't know what's happening. Ooh, wait, what's this? Definitely not my size. Ooh, are the 60s coming back? 70s, what style is that? Look what I found though, check it. Hold on, this two-tone with butt, you gotta tell me. This is 60s, right? Maybe, or I don't know. Anyway, two-piece sets will always be my number one love, but $40? I mean, probably worth it if you bought it separately. But that's real. This is really cute. Anyway, oh my gosh, a two-piece set! Stop! Another two-piece set. What size is this? Is it pants? A skirt? A pants? It the gaucho pants? Pants? <laughs> Do we love this? I don't know if it would fit me. Should I take it home? Try it on? Oh my gosh, that is a bit wild for me. Love the concept though. Love that. I actually have a lot of nice workout clothes here. A lot of the things they sell come in like sets of two, so that's really cool. And holy fajoli, is this like a Stanley dupe with the straw and everything? This is what I need, but this won't, I can't find my purple one anywhere. I've looked high and low um, with the straw like this, but this won't fit in my cup holder, which is annoying. But if that's all I have, all they have, I'll take it because I know that it keeps your water cold for like, I don't know, two days. This will probably fit in the cup holder, but I need more water than that. 20 ounces, or I would like more water than that. How many is this? 32 ounces. Okay, well, I'm gonna keep on looking. Well, should I just get this one then? Oh wait, Hydro Peak. This one comes with a straw. Oh, this one's 32 ounces too. They have three people movement. Oh, check this one out. It's like, you can get any top you want with it, so that's fun. Well, I just heard they have free people movement for like 10 bucks, but the uh, workout aisles are so stinking packed. So I'm coming over here, and can you just cry thinking about Wolfgang wearing this 24 month, maybe like a nine month, but it just seems so stiff. I don't know, I don't like putting them in. Oh my gosh, matching, matching? 2T for Meredith and Wolfgang. Oh my gosh, what if I, oh, this is Wentworth size? Okay, now I have to find, oh, no, mm -mm, they don't have it. Okay, they have 
Wentworth. Okay, they have Wentworth and Meredith. But again, it's just so dang stiff. Oh, the yellow top, that might be a little better, right? Not so like matchy matte. Well, I mean, it's very matchy matchy still. Oh my gosh, and then the mint over here with the seersucker. This is capturing my heart. Goodness, what size is this? I could cry. Oh, sad news. I don't think they have the bigger girls sizes here. I don't know, this is really cute too. Here are bigger girl sizes, but nothing that like matches, you know? Hmm, I'm gonna look around. Lots of Valentine's Day stuff. Oh yeah, bathing suits too. Okay, this is hard because let me tell you, at Target, they had nothing for 12 and under, 12 month and under. They might not here either. Like I live in Florida, you know, Wolfgang needs a bathing suit. Okay, I found for the three younger kids. Is this like too, too much? Is this like, okay, Kim, who are you? Like, what have you done with my friend? Not too much. I also haven't even looked at the price. It might be ridiculous. Oh my gosh, $20, but it comes with a hat. Like this is adorable. I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I don't know. These pants, I did find these. Ooh, a small. <gasps> look how comfortable these look. Okay, let's find a medium. Oh, these are not the same pants. Disappointment in my voice. It's a small, I can't fit my rear end in a small these days. Found one for Eleanor. It's not really her size, but I feel like she could fit into this. It's a top, like she could totally fit into this. She's pretty petite. Okay, one more. Maybe I can find one up here. Let me see. I feel like it's probably a good thing that I don't have more time in here. Oh my gosh, foaming hand soap. Found it. Found the Mecca. See, why do they hide it from us? Sweet peeps. Oh my gosh, the kids will probably like that one. Lemon sugar too. All right, I'm gonna take a whiff on that. Okay, pick two of those peep things up. They have a lot of headbands for this season. Uh, finally, found the nail polish, a weird place to have it. Plumping nail polish? I'm so confused. I am really confused. Ooh, I do like this color though. And this pink on my nails, it's called like flamingo something. I'm like out of it. I really like all the colors they have out. Very springy and good price. It's like five bucks. It used to be like three, but you know, thank you inflation and all that good stuff but online it's like 12, so you're still getting a good deal. They shove so much stuff in the checkout. Like how, how can I even shop when I'm feeling the pressure, you know? So much pressure. I know I didn't do a good job going through the kids stuff. They had a lot of newborn stuff too, but the books, they usually have a really good price on all of their books, like 10 bucks for this, five minute stories. Check this ABCs of kindness. They usually have all the classics too. I don't see any right here, but they typically have a lot of like the seasonal stuff. Very Hungry Caterpillar, $8. Well, I feel like it used to be like five, but uh, they typically have a lot of seasonal books and the classics. They cost as much as a greeting card these days, you know? Okay, that is it. Thank you guys so much for watching and shopping around with me. Hope you saw some really cool stuff and you were able to window shop around a little bit. I enjoyed my time with you. Now it's time to get home, back to the grind motherhood. I can feel that he's hungry. Okay, bye. If you want to subscribe, put a little happy in your day. I'll see you next time.